Have you ever pondered on the roots of one of the world's oldest monotheistic religions, Zoroastrianism? An ancient faith steeped in mystery, Zoroastrianism is a religion that hails from the sands of ancient Persia, now known as Iran. As we traverse the corridors of time, we find ourselves enveloped in a rich tapestry of history, myth and spirituality, all woven together in the enigmatic origins of Zoroastrianism. The significance of Zoroastrianism in the annals of religious history cannot be understated. It is often hailed as the first religion to espouse a clear monotheistic belief system, predating Judaism, Christianity and Islam. Yet, despite its significant contributions to religious thought, Zoroastrianism remains shrouded in obscurity to many. The origins of Zoroastrianism are steeped in mystery, and the exact timeline of its inception remains a subject of scholarly debate. Some historians trace its roots back to the second millennium BCE, while others argue that it didn't take shape until much later, around the 6th century BCE. Regardless of the differing perspectives, what remains undisputed is that Zoroastrianism emerged from the cradle of ancient Persia, a civilization renowned for its grandeur and cultural richness. The faith is anchored in the teachings of a prophet, yet the details of his life and the exact period he lived are shrouded in ambiguity. This prophet's teachings would become the cornerstone of Zoroastrianism, shaping a religious landscape that would influence civilizations for millennia to come. This religion, born in the heart of Persia, would eventually spread its wings, reaching distant corners of the world and imprinting its mark on various societies. It is a testament to the enduring power of its teachings and the resilience of its followers. Yet, to fully comprehend the depth of this faith, we must journey back into the sands of time and uncover the life of the Prophet at its heart. As we delve deeper into the past, we encounter an individual central to the Zoroastrian faith, a man named Zarathustra. His story, much like the origins of the faith he inspired, is a fascinating tale of intrigue, spiritual awakening and enduring faith. Who exactly was Zarathustra, and why does he hold such a pivotal role in Zoroastrianism? Let's journey back to approximately 1,500 years before the Common Era, to the ancient lands of Persia. Here we find our enigmatic figure Zarathustra, also known as Zoroaster. His very name is a beacon, meaning owner of the golden light, and it aptly reflects his teachings that illuminate the heart of Zoroastrianism. Zarathustra was more than a man. He was a prophet who brought forth a new religion, a new ethos. He taught a monotheistic faith a rarity in an era of polytheism, where gods were as numerous as the stars. Zarathustra introduced the idea of a single supreme deity, Ahura Mazda, the wise lord, a revolutionary concept that laid the foundations for the world's major monotheistic religions. But Zarathustra's teachings weren't confined to divine matters. He brought forth a profound ethical philosophy, an understanding of the world as a battleground between good and evil. He preached that humans weren't mere spectators in this cosmic conflict, but active participants. Each individual, according to Zarathustra, held the power to choose between righteousness and wickedness, between truth and deceit. His teachings emphasized the importance of good thoughts, good words and good deeds, a mantra that echoes throughout Zoroastrianism. Zarathustra's vision was not just about personal ethics, but extended to social responsibility. He taught that every individual's actions contribute to the cosmic struggle, influencing the world's fate. In this way, Zarathustra placed a great deal of responsibility on the shoulders of each believer, urging them to lead lives of virtue and righteousness. His teachings, revolutionary for their time, gave birth to Zoroastrianism, a faith that would play a crucial role in the spiritual, cultural and political life of ancient Persia. Today, his teachings continue to resonate, reminding us of the power of choice and the impact of our actions on the world around us. Zarathustra's teachings formed the bedrock of Zoroastrianism, a faith that would shape the course of history in ancient Persia. How did Zoroastrianism, born from the teachings of a single man, spread across an empire? Zoroastrianism began its journey in ancient Persia, where it was adopted as the state religion under the Achaemenid dynasty. The Achaemenids, led by the likes of Cyrus the Great and Darius, ruled over a vast empire that stretched from the Indus River in the east to Egypt and Greece in the west. This widespread rule facilitated the spread of Zoroastrianism far beyond its birthplace. However, it was under the Sasanian dynasty, the last pre-Islamic Persian empire, that Zoroastrianism truly flourished, 
The Sasanians not only promoted Zoroastrianism within their empire, but also sought to standardize its teachings and practices. This resulted in the creation of the Avesta, the holy book of Zoroastrianism, and the establishment of a priestly class, the Magi, who played a crucial role in preserving and propagating the faith. Zoroastrianism's spread was not limited to political boundaries. Its influence pervaded other religious traditions as well, notably Judaism, Christianity and Islam. For instance, the Zoroastrian concept of an ongoing struggle between good and evil found echoes in these Abrahamic faiths. The notion of a Messiah, a Saviour, who would come at the end of times is another significant Zoroastrian contribution to these religions. Moreover, the Zoroastrian tradition of honoring the elements, particularly fire, left its mark on religious practices across the region. The reverence for fire as a symbol of purity and divine light can be seen in the eternal flames kept in Zoroastrian temples, a practice later adopted by other religions. But perhaps the most profound influence of Zoroastrianism lies in its ethical teachings. The emphasis on truth, righteousness and personal responsibility for one's actions resonated with many and continues to do so even today. Zoroastrianism's influence reached far beyond the borders of Persia, leaving a lasting impact on world religions. Its legacy can be seen in the ethical principles, cosmological ideas and ritual practices that have been incorporated into various faiths, demonstrating the enduring power and appeal of its teachings. So what are the central tenets that define the Zoroastrian faith? Let's dive into the profound depths of this ancient religion and unpack some of its core beliefs. At the heart of Zoroastrianism lies the concept of monotheism, with Ahura Mazda as the one omnipotent god. Ahura Mazda, translated as the wise lord, is viewed as the creator of all life, the source of all goodness and happiness. This deity is not remote or indifferent, but rather is intimately involved in the world and its affairs. A key principle in Zoroastrianism is the concept of Asha, which can be understood as the ultimate truth, the righteous order of the universe. Asha is the law that governs the cosmos, it's the divine order that Ahura Mazda established at the creation of the universe, it's the embodiment of truth, justice and righteousness. Now Zoroastrianism is known for its distinct dualistic cosmology of good and evil. This isn't a fight between two gods, but rather a cosmic struggle between the forces of order and chaos, truth and deceit, represented by Ahura Mazda and his adversary, Angra Mainyu. Followers are expected to align themselves with the good and resist the evil, a choice that reflects in their actions. Speaking of actions, the threefold path of Zoroastrianism is a defining feature of this faith. It's encapsulated in the phrase, good thoughts, good words, good deeds, this simple yet profound mantra serves as a moral compass guiding adherents in their daily life. It's a call to cultivate a positive mindset, speak truthfully and kindly, and perform acts of charity and kindness. The belief in the afterlife and the day of judgment is another core belief. Zoroastrians believe that their good deeds will be weighed against their bad deeds, and this will determine their fate in the afterlife. These principles are the essence of Zoroastrian faith guiding the lives of its followers. They offer a window into the rich tapestry of beliefs and practices that have sustained this ancient religion through millennia, shaping it into the profound and complex faith that it is today. Scene script. Fast forward to the present day, where does Zoroastrianism stand? Zoroastrianism, one of the world's oldest monotheistic religions, holds a unique place in our global tapestry. Today, it's estimated that there are between 100,000 to 200,000 Zoroastrians worldwide, with the largest communities residing in India and Iran. These figures, however, represent a steep decline from its heyday when it was the state religion of powerful empires. In the modern world, Zoroastrianism faces several challenges. Most notably, the religion's traditional laws of endogamy, or marrying within the faith, have led to a dwindling population. However, some Zoroastrian communities have begun to question and even challenge these customs, sparking discussions about the future of the faith. Despite these challenges, efforts are being made to preserve and promote Zoroastrianism. Educational initiatives have been launched to teach the younger generation about their religious heritage and the principles of good thoughts, good words and good deeds. The religion's rich history, philosophy and rituals are also shared through digital platforms, making them accessible to Zoroastrians and non-Zoroastrians alike. 
Moreover, Zoroastrianism continues to leave its mark on the world. Its teachings have influenced and continue to influence major world religions such as Christianity, Judaism and Islam. Furthermore, its environmental ethos, which emphasizes respect for nature, resonates with contemporary concerns about climate change and sustainability. Zoroastrianism also thrives in the hearts and minds of its followers. Their fire temples still burn brightly, their festivals are celebrated with joy, and their commitment to ethical living remains unwavering. In this way, they keep the spirit of Zoroastrianism alive, ensuring its continuity into the future. Despite the passage of millennia, the legacy of Zoroastrianism endures a testament to its profound influence and timeless teachings.